Hi guys, I'm Exit Chaos and welcome back to another episode of Sim Airport. We are building Singapore's Shanghai International Airport Terminal 1. Terminal 1 only because it's a pretty big airport. So what I've done is I've finished off some basic terminal pieces over here. So let's quickly get some doors in place. So I've moved also my drop off and my pickup zones to where they need to be. So let's pause the game for a second while we grab doors. Um, and I just want to get, I'm just going to kind of do um, some big doors in the middle over here. And to be honest, this entire section here is probably not going to be used by the entry pieces. So what we'll do is let's see about lining it up roughly with that piece over there. I think that's about good. And then what we'll do is we'll put uh, a few doors in. like that okay so we'll do that as a starting point check-in is going to be over here and moving people through into that side so that's pretty cool then we'll do some doors over here and i'm just gonna do yeah similarly probably let's start it over here let's give it a little bit of room one two uh, I think about three doors over there is probably good enough. Now we just need to make sure that we get ourselves some stairs. Let's start off with some stairs over here just so that we can get everything um, actually working. Stairs, uh, stairs up I'm assuming is probably, well actually where do we want it? Somewhere over here is probably about the right spot for it. Um, actually we don't want it all the way over there, to be honest. Actually, we've gone and screwed this up a little bit. It needs to be somewhere over here. So what we'll do is we'll just place it in somewhere over here. Yeah, I think it's a little bigger than we should have made it. Anyway, what we'll do is we'll just place it in somewhere over here. Ooh, actually, and it needs to be on that side. Somewhere over there. We'll start it off over there and we'll see. So at least we can get this area accessible. That is going to be the plan. We get that area accessible. Yep, that is just about right. So what we've done is we've got a lot of spare foundation down there, which we probably didn't need, given we only needed to actually do this little section in here at that level. Mm. So our road is also much longer than it needs to be. Anyway, not to worry, we can always sort that out a little bit later. So now we've got the basics of our airport up. Well, basics, we don't have anything in here, but at least what we have now is we can actually get our baggage claim area in place so let's get our baggage claim area and i'm going to do that as our baggage claim area to start with this side over here is going to be our sorting facility so i'm interested in actually getting a wall up here um, and of course what we're going to need to do is get some uh, some bathrooms down here at some point as well but we'll just get our basics in place there. Over here, on the other hand, what we're going to do is we're going to need our check-in area. So ticketing, right, is what they call it. Ticketing. So we're going to do ticketing. Um, so like that. Ticketing like that, huh? That looks to be kind of okay. And then what we're gonna do is we're going to funnel through the guys at the end over here to get to the... Um, so then we're not gonna go to security, then we're just gonna make sure that we're going to wall this area off. So wall. Um, so what we'll make sure is we do is we will wall that area. Yeah. Up to around, well, the entire one. And what I'll do then is we will place some doors in there. Doors. We again do uh, the nice big doors over here. And it's just to kind of replicate that. Oops, wrong button. Uh, kind of to replicate that this is where people are going to flow into our arrival area. Oh, I mean departure area. And then from there we need two gates so let's get ourselves some gates in place and i'm tempted to obviously start off with some small gates 
so we can get some of the smaller aircraft in place so is that is that a thing shall we do shall we do this as an arrangement I, I believe we should I believe we should do that as an arrangement so we can do a little one two uh, maybe we'll start off with two just to get the airport going then we're going to need a runway sorry so let's get a runway first uh, what's the difference really well we'll just get the concrete one um, and I'm hoping we can uh, we can get the bigger ones 787 where's my A380s oh there they go wow so it needs to be pretty pretty long to get us there actually that's okay we can squeeze it in give ourselves some taxiways luckily i did start it off over there okay so some taxiways why why is the taxiways being so painful with me so why on this side is there an issue sufficient clear from obstructions invalid placement okay well taxiway over there then okay well there we go so this one doesn't quite get where it wants to go but that's a good starting point for us right there so let the construction workers do their thing is this thing built where where are my construction guys now All of this is built. So where are they hanging out? Are we still building some stuff down here? Where are all my construction crews? Are they, are they working on this? That's built. Oh, they're working on this. Come on. Yeah, they're busy doing their thing over here. They're busy getting my... Um, getting the runway done. And I can immediately get uh, the planning removed um, for the bulk of this. Okay, that kind of gives us uh, the go ahead. Now, this is saying it requires at least one taxiway connection, which is underway, of course, which is underway. So for the first ones, we're just going to do the small ones over here. So let's just get some doors. Doors. Um, we're going to do the small doors over here. And the thing that I'm quite interested in doing, so what we'll do is we will actually build build ourselves little pens over here to have to house the people. So give ourselves some walls. Okay. Okay. And we're gonna run the wall, let's say a little something like that. Okay, that should be that should be sufficient really. And we're gonna do a similar thing right there and now what we're going to need to do is put some security in place over here so if we say um we are of course going to need uh actually we probably need to do this slightly differently Yeah, we're probably going to want to do this slightly differently in the sense that we need our walls. Hang on. So give me my walls over here again. Actually, let's get the security pieces in first. So security exits are going to, and we're going to rotate that um, like so. So what I'm going to do is security exits over here and security exits. Well, actually, they should probably be up here somewhere. Yeah, that's that's good. So sorry about that. We're gonna remove this, dismantle, dismantle. I believe there's a hotkey for this, which I will keep in mind. Okay, so that's kind of, and that looks doesn't look good at all. Um, and then what we're gonna do is we'll get a door over here. So give myself a door. So we're effectively double dooring it, right there. And what I want is a gate agent desk thingy gate agent uh, desk gate agent desk over here so we're going to just start with the one over here and 
We're similarly going to want to do one on this side. Okay, with another door um, at the back of it over there, we're going to want to do, yeah, so we could actually, to be honest, we can just do little pieces of it. Yeah, that's okay. I think, I think I've got a plan on how we're going to manage this piece. Okay, let's get security up and running again. Security, I would like to get ourselves to something that can actually work. So we need a security zone. Uh, and I'm not, it doesn't have to be massive, right? So if we do a bit of a security zone, it looks like something like that. Okay. We, I'm, I'm thinking two bag scanners. One. Okay, and a metal detector, metal detector, and a bag scanner. Not a usable position, and another metal detector. There we go with two ID check stands. One there and one there, and now how are we gonna? Now we just need some walls over here, walls to run us all the way there. Um, and I'm kind of tempted to just do, I'm kind of tempted, so we'll do like two little bathrooms over here. I'm kind of tempted to just do some doors. Um, so what we'll do is we'll just do uh, a door there and a door there. Okay, so as you go through security, you can then move into into this area. So here, of course, what we'll do is we'll do small queues. So let's get a bit of a queue in place over here. And I'll just do something um, pretty standard. Just a little something like this and then what we'll do is we'll do a little a little business class one on that side so what we'll do is we will assign to uh, and this one is not going to be that's there close and then this one is going to be assigned to there but also to this one over here which is going to be first class and flight crew as well there we go so there we go so this is kind of going to be our security setup can i get rid of that close is what i'm looking so that's going to be kind of our what's going on over here assigned to this one what oh that's crazy okay hang on let's fix that quickly uh pause the game while we do funny stuff like this I don't want to get too much okay so let's just get rid of that and what we'll do is we'll just expand it ever so slightly that way there we go close that thank you very much there we go so this is very basic kind of stuff um and yeah that's kind of what we have in mind here i don't think we need to do anything more what we can do is we can do two bathrooms over here we can give ourselves a, a bit of a female restroom over here and a male restroom on the other side okay something like that we're going to give ourselves some walls okay that's going to be the setup right there we're going to give ourselves a little bit of a door there and there and now we've got an area so this is going to be our first set of gates what i'll do is i will run my walls up here as well and we'll get our security um, our security exits, um, security exit please, over there, uh, it goes like that I believe. So this should give me a good idea of our security overlay, right? So that's a secure zone, um, I believe as soon as that's built, and that's built, the entire section here will become secure. That's the hope, secure. Yes, no, maybe. 
Honestly, not. This should be secure, guys. Hang on, let's uh, pop out of there. Requires a secure area, requires at least one gate agent to be assigned. And that, still not. If I dismantle that, will this thing become secure? It shouldn't, shouldn't be an issue that like that, right? Uh, oh, do I have to assign it? I can't, I generally can't remember. Do I have to, I don't have to si assign secure zone. Secure zone is a airport CEO thing. This one does it automatically and for some reason it's not actually figuring out that this area is supposed to be secure. Maybe... Why is that? Why is it it's not secure? Maybe it's because it wasn't secure to start with? Okay, hang on, let's just slow things down a little. Okay, go to ticketing, that's the next step for us. So what I wanna do is if I look at these things, um, we would want to do some ticketing desks. What does this say? You're missing some staff. Security times six. Well, let's hire them and see if that makes any kind of difference in terms of the secure zones. Now let's get ourselves some ticketing, ticketing desks, oops, ticketing desks. And the ticketing desk runs in this kind of orientation. So what we'll do is we'll try and get ourselves something that actually, let's, ooh. and if we go downstairs, just wanna see, <laughs> We're actually out of luck over here. Well, that's okay. Maybe that's fine. Maybe that is fine. What we're going to, and we might expand this a little bit in inwards. But the idea is generally that we are going to do um, our baseline ticketing over here. And we'll do a little bit. Is it like two spaces or should we do three instead? Um, let's cancel. Let's cancel that project. We'll cancel there and we'll cancel it there. We'll give it three spaces instead. We won't get it too cramped. Yeah, that's that's kind of the plan. Okay, there we go. And what we'll do is we'll get ourselves ready for. Yeah, that's a little weird. Um, we'll get ourselves ready for baggage, baggage handling, baggage conveyor down transition, right? A little something like this. Yeah, okay, let's cancel, cancel those two and we'll give ourselves a little bit more room for our uh, conveyor down transition um, right over here. So we'll get it built and that's going to be our ticketing pieces right there. So let's speed things along so these guys can do their thing and we will get some queues up and running over here. Um, we'll do a business class on this side. Bit of a queue there and then what we'll do is the rest of these guys will do a bit of this. Something like that, okay. And now what we'll do is assign to this one here, which will be, there we go. And this will be assigned, this will be just like that. So assign there, close, assign here and close, assign here and close, and assign here and close. We're gonna do something similar for the other side as well. So ticketing is up and running. This isn't working. Is do we have a secure area? We don't. Why is that the case? Can I let me have a quick look? If I ex, ex, just ex, uh, extend the security area a little bit, like so, right? What does that do? Why does it not want to give that a secure? Did I put these things the wrong way around? That should obviously be secured, right? Uh, sector display. So why is this not secured? Oh, is it? Hang on. 
The outside is not secure. That's the issue. The outside is not secure. That's the issue. Okay, let's do this. Let's get ourselves some fences. And um, this might be quite problematic now, I'm just thinking. Unless we just do it up to there and that should secure it on this side. And what we'll do is uh, we'll do very similar piece of secure work right over there. Something like that. Hopefully, will will end up securing the um, will end up securing that area. I think that'll be that'll be good if that can actually happen. Perfect. So what this means is we can check in, um, drop off, check in. I need some more queues over there. They can make their way over this way. We need some staff to obviously work these desks. Uh, like 10 of them for now is what we're gonna grab ourselves okay so hopefully this will all be worked a one uh, actually this is it's going to be the D, D gates here right so give me um, and I'm, I'm just gonna do that D1 right there and this is gonna be uh, D2 right D2 perfect so that's in place hopefully once that's all built um, on the other side as well things should be secure still unfortunately not um, hmm still unfortunately not and I'm worried about this section right here so let's get ourselves a bit of a fence again we cannot we cannot can we if we do fence right there will that solve things I believe this oh my goodness you know what what I didn't think about is the fact that this should be the extent of the fence so please build the fence over there hopefully that piece um, will secure this if not we may have to tweak this road layout a little bit so let's get I'm hoping let's get this piece of fence built over here so we can see if that works speed things up so we can see that then from ticketing to we obviously need bathrooms here we obviously need maybe some bathrooms over here as well Has that been built now can we switch off the planning I can't remember how the planning view is uh, yes planning off excellent planning off uh, it's in the middle of the night and it's secure it's secure okay that worked so perfect that as secure Secured by a security zone. Excellent. Now, pause. Give me back. Take out that. Give me back my doors. That I've lost. Squeeze my door in there because I want a door there. Okay, now let's get ourselves. We need a sink, a toilet stall, and a urinal over here. So let's get a sink. No. I've got some sink. Okay. Uh, shall we just do something very basic like that toilet stalls toilet stalls okay and some urinals is that is that feasible okay and on this side we just need sinks and toilet stalls so give me some sinks again over here like that and like that and some toilet stalls and we will just kind of run in three of them like so and see if that actually works so that can be built that should sort itself out we require to be assigned to an aircraft gate so please assign over here thank you very much and we'll assign you over there thank you so those are assigned now we're going to need a little bit of queuing over here so we're we're missing some staff of course of course we're missing staff let's buy two more staff members uh, what are we missing over here runway must be functional what's wrong with the runway at least one connected taxiway on both ends uh, so I believe that piece should be sufficient. The one that worries me now is this piece over here. 
taxiway does not actually squeeze in there so if I go ahead and say um, take the runway and can I are oh, you you're not honestly no no it worked on this side obviously it doesn't work on this side okay I need to okay pause it let's just get rid of this runway piece over here is suitable for too short too short for all aircraft so if am I gonna have to dismantle this entire runway um, we are supposed to be able to extend it right under upgrade you should be able to extend the runway runway lights PAPI but you should also be able to extend the runway or can you just extend it in general okay guys what i'll do is in between episodes i will fix the runway thank you so much for watching hopefully in the next one we'll start seeing our first flights come in and then with that operation we'll start expanding and learning and all these kind of good things okay thanks for watching see you next time bye bye